Ladies and gentlemen, it's 3.33 in the morning. I just I can't sleep, ladies and gentlemen. I've been thinking about the Super Bowl every single day. Everywhere I go, everywhere I walk, I'm just... I'm thinking about Arik Armstead's fat ass, why he's making TikTok videos. I just don't understand it. But today, Retro Bowl is predicting the winner of Super Bowl 58. Two years ago, when I made a similar video to this, Retro Bowl correctly predicted the Super Bowl winner between the Rams and the Bengals. So what I'm telling you is you should put your fortune on whoever it predicts in this video today. Go all in. Stack all your chips because this is 100% accurate, all right? We have the Retro Bowl Finals on Retro Bowl against Kansas City. You know who I'm repping, all right? You know where I'm streaming. Possibly the last live stream you'll ever see out of me. Here are the boys. Oh, I'm getting emotional just looking at them. Okay, let's start from the back. Fat ass. Jake Moody. Top five worst human being on planet Earth. I don't know. He's not worth a third round pick. Apparently John Lynch thinks he's worth a third round pick. No kick range. No accuracy. Definitely no speed. I, I mean, this guy, he, he just sucks. My goodness, man. He's been inconsistent all year. I, I swear, if we lose a Super Bowl because of Jake Moody, I'm gonna lose my mind. I'm gonna lose it. Brother, please, just, just make the extra points. If we're within the 40... Go for it. We're not kicking field goal. We're not getting three. That three is not guaranteed with this dude on the field. All right, we cannot have him kicking field goals this Sunday. But that defensive back. My boy, Charvarius Ward, a.k.a. Lil Mooney. Y'all saw what he said. Y'all saw that. Y'all know that San Francisco is better than KC. He's been playing lights out this year. He's DK's dad. And we just got to cover Kadarius. Who's like also in the top five worst human beings on planet Earth? Like we just need to cover him. Tiberius, man, I, 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 bring it home, bro. <laughs> you're like you're like our Deion Sanders. That, that's what he's like. I'm not saying he's Deion Sanders, but like the last time he won a Super Bowl, we had Deion Sanders. These are Deion Sanders. Next to Charverius, we have one of my favorite parts of the 49ers team, the linebacker core. Oh my God. We have Patrick Willis and Navarro Bowman reincarnated. Dre Big Play Greenlaw with two picks against the Packers and a monstrous performance against the Lions. This guy's probably been our MVP so far in the playoffs. He's been playing amazing. I just love him. You know, he's just one of those guys that he inflicts CTE, but like legally. Like he's a last of the dying breed in terms of like the mid-2000s, 90s linebacker. He plays that style. I just need you to make some plays, man. Please, Drake Greenlaw, don't let me down. I believe in this man, man. He's going to carry us to success. Four and a half star linebacker. Next to him, we got all pro friend. The man, the boy, the best linebacker in the NFL. Roquan Smith can go suck my dick. Just an elite linebacking core, man. I'm telling you guys, they, they, this, they're 57 and 54. They might be better than 52 and 53. I'm going to need you guys to play lights out because we have this TikToker. Oh, I, I can't even, I, I don't even want to say his name. Dude, this guy just, uh, I, I, like my brain hurts right now. Dude, this guy, he posted two new TikToks, guys. Two new TikToks. He's probably posting another one by the time I finish editing this video. Like, we don't care. We, we really don't. Like, can we just lock in and get a sack? Can we stop the run? Buddy, clog some holes. Can we just win a rep? God damn, bro. Stop posting shorts, bro. Piss me off, man. Then we got Nick. Nick played great against the Lions. Nick, I'm gonna need you to wake up, Nick. Nick, wake up! This guy played so well against the Chiefs last time we played them in the Super Bowl, man. And I still remember that forced fumble. You know what I'm saying? I still remember when he got held on third and 15. You feel me? Like, Nick Bosa, if y'all don't know him, you know, he doesn't really show that much emotion. But he was in tears after that game. You know what I'm saying? That game meant a lot to him. And so I'm gonna need to get back. I'm gonna need you to come through for us, Nick Bosa. Please make some big plays this Sunday. But here we go. Probably the best offense the most talented offense in the NFL at left tackle we have the best player on the 49ers possibly the best player in the NFL the standard for left tackles for offensive linemen in the United States of America Trent Williams is in the building You know what I'm saying? I just need some of that, Trent. I need some syrup in my pancakes, too. I need some syrup. I need some syrup, Trent. I need some syrup. His first ever Super Bowl in his whole career that was tainted by the Commanders. You know, he was on the Commanders for a while, but this is the first Super Bowl that he's made. You gotta win it for him, man. He's like 34 or 35. He, he's, he, he damn near 
about to die. Like, come on, man. We got to win one for him. He, he's the most reliable player. I'm not worried about him. He's not going to give up a sack. He's going to play well. All right? Just don't get hurt out there. Go get that ring. Now, I know I said this earlier in the video, but I'm going to say it again. This is one of my favorite parts of the 49ers team. The wide receivers. The wide house. Let me start with all pro IU. That wide receiver, man. This guy, he, he saved our season. He, he, he really saved our season. The catch against the Lions. The catch against the Packers. This guy just makes big time plays and big time moments. He's a top five receiver in the NFL. Justin Jefferson ain't better than him. No, I, I, I ain't going for that. CD Lamb ain't better than him. Mm -mm. We're not having that discussion. You want to put Tyree Kill in the conversation? Shuh. I don't think so. I'm not doing all that. I don't think I'm taking anybody over 11. What was he, like 33rd in targets this year? And 5th in receiving yards? When has that ever happened? Next to him. He was part of that 2019 team. I just get emotional every time I think about that, man. Because, like, we should have won it. We should have won it for Emmanuel. We should have won it for sure. Please, brother. Please hit the pater. Please get in the end zone this week, Debo. Please. I need you, man. Next up, Jorge. The best tight end in the NFL. Taylor Swift can go Sugma. Mr. Pfizer can go Sugma. All right, we got Jorge. The only complete tight end left. The last of a dying breed, just like Dre Greenlaw. Don't forget when they called for OPI against my man when that was not an OPI. It wasn't an OPI. He said he gonna be back in the Super Bowl. He said he gonna be back with a vengeance. I better see a hundred yards, Jorge. Or else ain't no vengeance. I need that chip, Jorge. He's done miracles on me. He's getting in the end zone. I don't care. He might get in three times. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll be honest with you guys, man. This is the only way we're going to beat the Chiefs. We have to outscore them. Because we also got to consider the fact that we got Steve Wilkes back there. And Arik Armstead. And Chase Young. Who round out the top five worst human beings list. So I need CMC to get in the end zone, man. I need Debo in the end zone. I need Ayuka in the end zone. I need Kiddo in the end zone. I need all these boys in the end zone. Because we got to outscore Patrick Mahomes. That's the only way we can win this suit. Because we ain't stopping him. <laughs> you think Steve will stop him? <laughs> but the man. <sighs> oh, my mental health is in his hands. Please beat the allegations, Brock. Brock, there's so much unnecessary hate on you, Brock. I need it, I need it, I need it, I need it. People still think you're a game manager, Brock. Even after everything you've done, they still think you're a game manager. Joe Montana, Steve Young, Brock Purdy. Oh, that'd be special. He is in the building, and that is the full roster on Retro Bowl here. Here we go. Retro Bowl Finals against the Kansas City Chiefs. Who is going to win it on Retro Bowl? I'm telling you, this is going to tell us a lot about the Super Bowl. Get your betting money ready. I am encouraging you to bet based on how this game on Retro Bowl plays out. That is right. I am a financial advisor. Retro Bowl at 4 in the morning. Super Bowl 58. Let's get into it. All right, we received the ball. Brock Purdy on the sidelines. Taylor Swift up in the booth. Come on, man. Oh, I forgot to select that kick returner. It's okay. Our special teams is booty anyways. Ray Ray McLeod, you better get the painter. You better do something on Sunday, Ray Ray. I need you on Sunday. Jorge, Jorge. Viva la Mexico. Viva la Mexico. Viva la Mexico. Como estas? Como estas? Vivo. Wow! Debo! Wow! Third down. Third down. Jorge. Jorge. Oh, Jorge wants one. Oh, 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 Did I just experience lag? Like, okay, give it to CMC. Give it to CMC. Give me to CMC. When in doubt, give it to Christian McCaffrey. Kyle Shanahan, if you're watching this video, this is how you should be running the offense. This, this is exactly how you should be running things. Just give it to him. Just give it to him. Look, 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 look at Big Trento. Look at Big Trento. Serving up the pancakes with the syrup. And then when they blitz, you find Jorge. You find Jorge. You know what I'm saying? I call this a retro ball playbook. I'm literally giving you the formula on how you're going to win this game. Feed Jorge. Feed CMC. Okay? Feed Jorge. Feed CMC. Look at Jorge. Look at Jorge.
como esta, como se llama mami, la bad bunny, J Balvin, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, and you, you, people forget how good Brock is at scrambling, 8 -0. what a start for the, oh, Steve Wilkes, this is how the Super Bowl's gonna go on Sunday, oh, the champagne's in the fridge, oh my goodness, man, oh my, oh, Brock Purdy on the money, once again, Jorge, Jorge's play out of his mind, I actually, I need this Jorge on Sunday, I, oh, wow, See, that's Colton McKivitz right there. Third and eight, third and eight, third and eight. Brock's gonna put it on the money, though. Brock's gonna make the right read. He's gonna put it on the money. Oh, George, 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 George! Oh, my God. B.A., B.A., round him up. Tss, tss. All pro B.A., all pro B.A., all pro B.A. Y'all didn't want to vote him in the Pro Bowl? Greenlaw missed the tackle. You're t Where's Ari? Get B.A. involved, though, man. We, got, we need some B.A. We need some B.A. You know what I'm saying? We need some B.A. Let's stop the clock here. Let's man up some clock. Oh, my God. Yo, I am playing great Retro Bowl right now. I can't even lie, guys. Y'all see this gameplay? Y'all see this gameplay? Y'all know this is extreme, right? Y'all know George Kittle came to play, right? Y'all know George Kittle. He gonna have a big Sunday, right? Bet the George Kittle over right now. I ain't your financial advisor, but bet the George Kittle over. We are up 22 to 7 at halftime. Can this please happen? Can we just have this gameplay as a Sunday game? This is amazing. This is the... Charverius missed the tackle. Okay, all right. Kansas City, they're gonna put up points. This is going to happen. Okay, we we know Steve Wilkes' game very well. He does. He's not fooling me. Here we go. Here we go. CMC. Good CMC the ball. Good CMC the ball. Good CMC the ball. First down. First down. Come on, Zebras. Come on, Zebras. Give me that first down. Give me that first down. Yep. You know what I'm saying? I knew he was gonna get that first down. You know why? White privilege. I'm just kidding. I mean, it was a joke. It's a joke. Come on, man. Offense is flowing well. CMC stiff arm. Four yard gain. I like what I see. Put the ball in his hands. Kyle, this is the formula. Put the ball in Christian McCaffrey's hands. Good things happen. Third and two. Third and two. Trent lead blocking. Come on, man. You know we gonna get that first down. We gonna move the chains. We gonna control time of possession. This is how we gotta play on Sunday, guys. You guys see how he sound? Come on. NFL Network. Can I get higher? Somebody, man. ESPN, ESPN Deportes, somebody. I, I need to get higher. Jesus, man. Christian McCaffrey. First down. 49ers. Oh, oh, oh. Third and seven. We're within the 30. We can't kick. We have Jake Moody. We got BA on a deep post. We got BA on a deep post. This thing about Purdy does. About Purdy. No, 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 my brain can't handle that. I can't, I can't handle that. If I see that on Sunday, I might get a heart attack. No, 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 no. Oh, my gosh, that was too slow. Here we go. Here's the real sim, ladies and gentlemen. Th this is what is supposed to be happening. Oh, my, oh, oh, Steve Wilkes. Field goal? Oh, I love it, Andy Reid. All right, run CMC, run CMC, run CMC. Three-yard game. Just keep running CMC. I don't care if this game plays boring, guys. I, I need this win. I, I don't know why, but I after this win, I'll feel better. I think I'll be able to sleep. It is also 4 a.m., but, but I, I, I need this win on Retrable. I, I need to feel something. I need to feel a victory over Kansas City. Fourth down or field goal. Oh, my God. 122 left. No, we got to go fourth down. I, I can't trust Jake Moody. I am putting the ball in his hands. Oh, blitz, blitz. Jorge, Jorge, como estas, mi amigo? Oh, now we got Debo, now we got Debo. Oh, don't put the ball in Debo's hands now. Oh, don't put the... Debo. Whoa! Whoa. One, oh, two left. Niners have time of possession. Oh. <laughs> if this happens on Sunday, I'll go crazy. Oh, my God, oh, my God. Pitch it, pitch it, pitch it. CMZ. The code is my boy in the game. CMZ. Third and three, a first down. I need it, I need it. Brock puts it on the money. Jorge Kittle. CMC, CMC. That gonna go ahead and off. CMC up the middle. Jake Brendel. That boy does not know what he's doing, man. Chiefs going goal line. I don't care. We're giving it to CMC for the touch. That's it. That's one of the best retrable games I've played in recent memory. Oh my god, guys, this is a sign. Guys, bet the house on the Niners. If you can't gamble, it's okay. Cheer for the Niners. Tune into the live stream. It very well may be the last live stream I actually ever have in my life. Guys, I might not watch football after this game. If we lose, I'm not watching football no more. I'm not doing that anymore. Why would I do that to my own mental health? Why would I, why, 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 why? I can't handle another Super Bowl loss. I'm not doing that. George Kittle was named Retro Bowl MVP. Oh my goodness. Yeah, he was the best player. He was easily the best player on the field. I, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, y'all saw what y'all saw. Brock played amazing too. 249, three touchdowns. Yeah, that's all I need. That is all I need out of you, Brock. CMC, amazing. Kittle. 203, two tutties. Oh my god, Ari, please. Retro predicts San Francisco will win. 
Rock Party MVP, hold on. CMC Offensive Player of the Year, Fred Warner Defense Player of the Year. I right. okay, okay, y'all teasing me a little too much. Vegetable predicts that the Niners will beat the Chiefs 30 to 18 for Super Bowl 58. Let me know your Super Bowl 58 predictions either in the comments down below or in the chat on the live stream on February 11th. I can sleep happy now. I can sleep with a little bit more relief. I'll see you guys on Sunday for Super Bowl 58. Bang, bang.